More devil shades. Now we're in trouble. What? Usually we leave enough to deal with two or three encounters, but we were already pretty stretched with those uh, vampiric alithid. Looking for, uh, gonna need more distractions. Hope we should get this off right away. Speak your mind. All right, fire elemental. <laughs> I just swore. Sire? I think she's gonna go with cutthroat this time. Fopain? I'm not sure she was hitting that often. Yes? Kithix. Injured. Open has no effect. I await your need. All right, giving uh. Here are some plus four bullets. Shaw guides my hand. My blade will cut you down. What is it? Something amiss. Victory shall be ours. Avery, Beware. Guide my blade. Your knees are mine. I think Lily would just had a wild surge. Yes. Almost looks like Kithix is hostile. Oh. Alright. I am yours to command. I am yours to command. Next time. By Uncle Spanky Stump! Gotcha good. Your life should be I think there's only one left. The group needs me? Beware! Your knees are mine! Shaw guides my hand. Yes? Are you willing to continue if needed? You better stop and rest. Alright. I'm War Sire. Boy, those devil shades though, replicating into other shadows. <laughs> what a, a pain. All right. Jahira becoming. Yeah, and both. Okay. Looks like. Right? All right. Gaining some spells. 
Oh, and abilities. Look at this. Oh, boy. Yeah, I haven't looked at any of these because, again, I thought this wasn't going to come into play until people had reached 20th level. Only a flurry of super fast blows. Tax per round to 10. Penalty to damage. Jira's not quite the, the fighter, though. Death blow. So I guess these are all for the fighter, I think. Reserve things like that for somebody like Mazzy. Resist magic. Four rounds, magic resistance for 50%. Power attack. This reminds me of feats. Maybe this is the second edition <laughs> equivalent of feats. Yeah, it's more fighter oriented. War cry. Panicked. <laughs> that sounds like Jahira though. To emit a war cry. Panic our enemies. Fifty forty percent resistance to physical damage. That's something it sounds like her. Energy blades. Looked at some of these. Storm of Vengeance. We're allowed to pick two of them. Oh boy. Acid rain, earthquakes, and lightning. Sounds like a Jahira spell. All enemies of 8th level or lower are slain instantly. It's not saying whether this would injure party members, though. Elemental summoning. This probably what she'll take then. Holy cow. 10% chance that an elemental prince will be summoned. All right, so I think that'll be probably one or greater elemental. That's the next stage. Oh, look at that. <laughs> greater elemental summoning. I think uh, Lily's gonna <laughs> ask Jahira to research that, probably. Because the fire elemental has been useful. Global blades. No. Some of Diva. I think Lily would be jealous. She just got dark planetar. planetar. <laughs> she doesn't want to be upstaged by a Diva. Potion. Wow. Mass raised dead. So I want that. Aura of flaming death. <laughs> Grants the user ninety percent fire resistance. Uh all right. So what's the difference then? Greater elemental versus uh, fire elemental. Oh, transformation. It's interesting, but it's still uh, Jahira. <laughs> Don't want to necessarily put her in uh, harm's way. If it was a summon, that would be different. I think we'll go with uh, greater elemental summoning. by uh, Lily's request. All right. I think it makes sense. Is that what this is? Try it out. The very ideal of beauty
They become helpless, smitten with her beauty. Okay, what a strange spell. And, uh... Yeah, Insect Plague is awfully useful. We've been needing this as well. Negative Plane Protection, probably paid to memorize two of those. Okay. Oh, I'm getting what sleepy. What is it? I wish we could stop for a bit. Wow, so we keep getting distracted by demon shades. Is that what? Devil shades. Alright, not this time. I think all this has really changed you. <laughs> Come on, this isn't like us at all. Ready and willing. You need my skills, I see. Something amiss? Alright, so I was talking about the Elf Skull Inn. Alright, and uh, the Sword Heralds in Cormir, which is a group of mages, and what they did, I guess, in more wild times is lords would want, I guess, the arcane equivalent of a safe room. So they create this extra dimensional space that they could flee to, I guess, if their estate was under attack, for example. <laughs> and uh, the key would be a sword, which is how the Sword Heralds got their name, and along with some common object that was personal to the owner. So, of course, these are all over the realms, I guess, in Cormir. These uh, entryways to these old safe rooms, I guess. So that's not really interesting as much in itself, but I think what is interesting is that a lot of them through history have been transformed into simply hiding places for treasure. So it's that progression or history of it where they used to be more or less safe rooms for a person have become these extra dimensional pockets where people now simply hide treasure or other uh, things they're trying to guard. I just like that idea that... Uh, Things are repurposed, for example, that uh, they don't serve their original purpose. All right, so I guess next time we might uh, look at what to do. We have three different colored oils and a flint and tinder. See if we can't get this door open, maybe. Might venture actually to talk to Karsten first. I doubt, can't see what he might know. But I guess that'll be next time. Been watching? Thanks, and uh, later.